When a salt dome begins to cave in, who do you call to solve the problem before it completely collapses? CDI Demolition are ready to prove why they're the right choice for the job. This experienced company is eager to demolish and clean up this dilapidated dome. So Shandros uh, reached out to us about a week ago about a salt dome that was commissioned uh, unsafe to enter. When we got here, there was nothing done, so we had to implement um, safety, do the permit process, demolition methodology, all the engineering plan. We did that within a week, and now we're here on Tuesday uh, demolishing the building for Shandros. Before CDI gets to dig into this salt dome, they hold an on-site safety meeting. So, hey guys, uh, we're starting a new project today. It's a big high profile project for these guys. Um, so we got to do a really good job here. Again, um, just be safe, do our safety inspections on the equipment, keep uh, the machines greased up and uh, we'll get going. Pretty much what we're doing is we're going to be demolishing the uh, salt dome roof structure. Um, the base will remain. We're not allowed to enter anything inside the roof structure. It is basically deemed unsafe, the roof is actually caving in. So what we gotta do is gotta work from the outside in. Everybody just be safe, wear your proper PPE all day, and uh, we'll be uh, ready to work, boys. Based on our sequence plan, what we're gonna do is we're gonna start crunching the machine counterclockwise. We're gonna work our way around. Once the building is encapsulated on itself, we're gonna use the entranceway. We're gonna basically back up the trucks with our traffic control plan. Um, with spotters and then we're going to do in and out runs about maybe nine to ten bins in one day and get this sucker cleaned up maybe in one to two days. The game plan is set and safety procedures are in effect. It's time to start pulling away the pieces of this salt dome. We're using a rotating demolition barrel grapple. When you're using a demolition barrel grapple, a lot of people comment that, you know, it's like an extension of your hand, which it really is. The job went, you know, just as planned. Blaze is a great operator, he knows what he's doing. Tomorrow we're gonna schedule a cleanup. Today is kind of, uh, you know, uh, pulverizing, getting the material ready for cleanup. Uh, we have three bins on site and then tomorrow the trucking will start. A four day job turned into a two day job and we get to spend time with our families for Christmas. Now that all the material is on the ground, CDI can clean up this mess. We were in Salt Dome yesterday. We had all walls and a roof above us, and today it's all down, and now we're doing cleanup. Well, I love watching it come down. As much as it hard work takes to come up, it takes a lot of hard work to come down, lots of planning, and you gotta do it right. It's very fun working with family. It's a family-run company, and it's great to be on for the ride. So this job went fantastic. Uh, we completed the job in less than two days and it went awesome. The last one for the year, so we're bringing in 2024 with a great new beginning. What a great way to end the year with this project. Thank you guys for everything. This one is done.